exchange fund is just like the opening one. It's going to be 2100 whatever is left in this um, orange box. And then you're going to type that number in here, and it's going to equal this number and finalize it. And then we're going to move on to deposits. So this is where you're going to take that long receipt that you print off the um, what's it called? end of day report or end of day sales report, I think. Um, off of the Loomis machine in the office. And that bottom number should match up with this total deposit number. If they don't match up, that means somewhere in the cash sale settlement, it is off. So let's say that when they dropped Nathan's drawer, he actually had, they actually dropped uh, 418.52 cents. So, and this is off by 52 cents. So that means that those papers that you have um, from everybody's money from the day, is not the same as what was put into the system. And this is the system. So when people count their drawers, they type in uh, 418, but he forgot the 52 cents. So now we have to go back and fix it and say that he actually had those 52 cents. So usually there would be a little pencil here again, you'd click on it and you would just type in um, 418.52. And then that would fix this number to be 52 cents more. And then that would, let's say that fixed it and that matches your receipt. So you're going to look at the bills accepted number at the very bottom. It's like the first number that says bills accepted. You're going to type that number in here. You're going to look at the cash amount, type that one. If there's any checks, you're going to type that one. And then these two numbers should match up. Uh, this one and this one. Or sorry, this one and this one. And then you're going to hit confirm deposit and it's going to say um, deposit confirmed by whoever. And then if it doesn't match up, it'll show red boxes around these and it won't let you confirm. So that's when you have to go back through and look and see who else's drawer is not uh, matching up with those slips. And then you might have to look through all of them and you might just have to look through a few to find them.